we just sort of wing it. I think that's basically what I do through life. But on the other hand, I have a very, very organized home behind all the chaos. Paris and Tyson Fury announced that they had welcomed their seventh child, a son, on Monday the 18th of September 2023. After revealing the news with a picture of them cradling their baby boy, both Paris and Tyson said they were over the moon and very prepared for baby number seven. I am a pretty dab hand at being prepared for new babies. I've done it six times before, so this time was no different. I think as long as you've got a car chair, a cot, and the nappies and milk, you're pretty set up. So yeah, I just take it very easily and find it um, find it quite quite a normal process for me. Um, obviously, when I was a first time mum, it was totally different. First time mother, uh, everything had to be so perfect. Everything had to be in place, and I was so nervous. Where now, a little bit more experience. Paris and Tyson are already parents to Venezuela, 13. Prince John James, 11. Prince Tyson II, 7. Valencia, 5. Prince Adonis Amaziah, 4. And Athena, 2. All of whom were surprised when they found out they had a new sibling on the way. Tyson and the kids uh, were really surprised when we all found out. Uh, we kind of kept it a secret, me and Tyson, from the big kids, because I have a teenage daughter who is definitely not keen on any more siblings but they have all come around to the idea just in time while paris and tyson were no doubt excited to expand their family there was an element of apprehension following paris's traumatic birth with their youngest child athena after the birth of my last daughter and we had all the complications um, with her heart once she was born and thank god everything is okay now I was a bit um, anxious about this new baby coming, worrying that there may be complications and problems, but thankfully everything's okay. Based on my own experiences, to all you first time mums, um, don't worry about everything. You know, it's just, you can't control it, literally right up to having the baby, bring the baby home, and everything that comes in between. You can't control what's gonna happen. Uh, you can just be prepared, so you can't prepare enough for your first baby. That would be my only recommendation. Make sure you've always got everything ready, everything at hand, and just ride with it. Don't expect yourself to do too much because it's a hard job. It's a really hard job. From being a hands-on mum and taking care of her house, to how she manages to make time for herself and keeping up with meal times. As a mum of seven, Paris is often asked time and time again how do you do it? To answer that very question, she has written a new book, giving fans an insight into life behind the scenes in her crazy household. Since my last book came out, so many people came up to me and basically asked me the question, which is the title of the book, How Do You Do It? And that's, now that's the title of the new book, How Does She Do It? And not that I feel like I have all the answers, I really don't, but I just thought I'd put out there how I live my life with everything that I do, the crazy schedule I've got, the six, seven children now. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to put my words into context and I feel like I got that in this new book. Paris's first book was Love and Fury, revealing a family insight into life living with a world champion boxer, complete with all its highs and lows. When I done my first book, I said I wouldn't do another because it was hard and I had a lot of personal feelings really involved in my first book, especially, um, talk about Tyson's mental health. And I, I brought that out for the reason to help people. So when they asked me if I wanted to do a second book, I said, well, I don't know what I can contribute. But then as the months went on, people kept asking me, how do you live your life? How do you do this? How do you do that? And I thought, you know what? That is what this book needs to be. And without giving too much away from her new book, we couldn't help but ask Paris, how do you do it? I go through my life very free willingly, very easy, very, headstrong of the fact that I will try anything and I'll never say no. I, if somebody says, can you do this? I'm like, I'll try, I will, I'll, I'll try it. And um, I think that's how I've managed my life because we travel constantly. We have seven children, we have a busy schedule. Um, Tyson has his work, I've got mine. And we just sort of wing it. I think that's basically what I do through life. But on the other hand, I have a very, very organized home behind all the chaos. And I think that helps me so much. So like 
I know where everything is. I'm very organized in the house and I can, I can do these things because of that. So I think the book just has a little insight into the backbone of my lifestyle. And I just, I'm giving you my opinion on how I sort of deal with it. And with seven kids, I feel like I'm doing okay.